When you have marketers that mm. don't have a merchant account, that don't have a staff, that doesn't have organization, they don't have structure, that want to do business with you because you are actually established. They run up numbers, crazy products on your services, on your, on, on your system, only to leave you hanging high and dry with products that you have never seen that they uh, vouch for, took all the money, leaving you hanging with whatever lawsuits that you got to do. I love you, Poppy. and dump thing is real. On so many levels. Let me explain to you what a pump and dump is. A pump and dump is when a marketer finds a good company. Well, there's two versions. They find a good company. They sell it to the moon. They sell it to the moon. They sell it to the moon in the hopes to get as much commission as they can, not caring if the company can actually fulfill that pump. They extract all their capital or their interest or their investment earnings from it, and then they run, leaving the company with all of the headache of trying to manage it all. That's one version. The second version is when these um, influencers online, when they tell you about a stock or a crypto that they know is filed, but they know they can get ten to 20,000 people go purchase it right now, It'll raise up the value just quick enough for them to get an exit of a higher number and then leave everybody else stuck in the coin or in the stock that was a bad coin stock pick. Now, this is what I would say. Market making, the ability to make a market, like do marketing behind it, advertising, get people excited about something. Ethically, it's when you're disclosing earnings and you're disclosing what's going on. But when people say, yeah, this is just a good stock, I believe in it. I've invested into it. Y'all, I can name you three people right now. I can tell you exactly what month that they got money from, from who they got the money from, that they received back in money, and then went publicly that same day on the internet, social media to be exact. They're in the East Coast, and they also are in the, uh, uh, the West Coast. They both they live in both Cali in Atlanta. Mm-hmm. Yeah, bruh. Quit playing with me. Received a specific amount of money, then went live on social media saying that they invested in this coin. Cap. Knowing that they received 40, was it, how much was it? 40K. It was $40,000 in Ether. Ethereum. In Ethereum. They received $40,000 exactly in Ethereum. Not only did they receive $40,000 exactly in Ethereum, they also got free coins from this uh, same place. And then before they did their marketing, they went back to the company. I hope you're listening because you know exactly who I'm talking and tried to. tried to demand another forty k. Tried to demand another $40,000. The person said no. They did the marketing to tell everybody they invested all this money into this crypto. Never invested their own dime their own dollar at all hmm. and the beautiful thing about cryptocurrency is that the wallets whether you believe or not you can read the transactions so you cannot delete a transaction report on cryptocurrency on the blockchain. blockchain so what does that mean that means it's there forever you know who i'm talking to and you know I'm talking to you. You got a year to start coming clean on the internet. Or I will start blasting every under table uh, wire that you ever received from every cryptocurrency company. Because you are not good for the black community like you pretend that you are. That's the problem that I have with people that pump and dump. Now let me go here. We got pumped and dumped. Woo. So this is why I feel away. And y'all, y'all sure. I'm so glad I'm in a space to just tell my truth. Talk that talk. When you have marketers mm. that don't have a merchant account, that don't have a staff, that doesn't have organization, they don't have structure, that want to do business with you because you are actually established. They run up, they run up numbers, crazy products on your services, on your on, on your system. Only to leave you hanging high and dry with products that you have never seen that they that they uh, vouch for, took all the money, leaving you hanging with whatever lawsuits that you got to deal with. That's the, what a pump and dump is. And but let me tell y'all the beautiful thing about the law. When people like that pump and dump companies like ours, 
You got four to seven years, depending on the type of fraud, <laughs> to go after that person mm. and give them not only civil lawsuits, but criminal lawsuits. And that's exactly what we're dealing with right now when a, a mogul showed that article. These tech investors invest into this technology. They go to the world, tell them how amazing it is just so they can raise up the value, extra, extrapolate their money. There you go, Grant Cardone, us with street talk, I guess, right? Um, extrapolate the money out of which means to take out Grant Cardone. Um, we, 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 we extrapolate that money and then they leave everyone else that owns that stock holding the bag while the market takes a hit after they got everything that they needed out of it. Mm. So if you ask me how I feel about that mogul, I feel a certain way. The reason that I feel a certain way is because how can you say that you're for the people wanting to teach them stocks? Wanting to teach them crypto, wanting to teach them investments, but you don't let your same audience know when you pumping and dumping them. Mm. At least tell them, hey, y'all, we I see a market. I see an opening. I don't know how long it's going to be. Those who rock with me, cool. You're going to be a part of us pumping it up. You don't say that because if you verbally say that, you know, it's illegal. Because if it were legal, you would tell everybody. Mm. But you're not legally doing it. You're illegally pumping up your own money, leaving everyone else with the bag, only with your own lie that you tell them, you should have got out when I told you to. Ooh. Or you didn't get in what in time. What I want you to understand is that I'm not giving y'all all the game for free on no goddamn on YouTube. You're going to have to join the Power Bank Society to really get that sauce, sauce. 